Europe could be left in limbo for several months with the latest German election exit polls and the race to succeed Angela Merkel showing a near-dead heat that will trigger lengthy talks over the formation of a new coalition government. The Social Democrats SPD, fronted by its Chancellor candidate Olaf Scholz, have edged ahead in the national election. Projected results have showed, putting them in poll position to lead a government for the first time since 2005. This result would also end 16 years of conservative-led rule under the departing Mrs. Merkel. Projections for broadcaster ARD showed the center-left SPD with 25.5% of the vote, marginally ahead of the CDU-CSU conservative bloc with 24.5%. The result would also mean the CDU-CSU slumping to a post-war low for a federal election. An Infratis DMAP poll for ARD also showed 38% want the SPD to lead the next government, compared to 28% backing the Conservatives. More than half wanted the Liberal Free Democrats and Greens to be part of a new government. Mr. Shields is the preferred Chancellor candidate with 45% of voters, with the Conservatives' Armin Laschet scoring just 20%, but the marginal gap between the political parties will trigger lengthy coalition talks will follow before a new government takes office. This will likely be the Greens and the Liberal Free Democrats FDP, but talks could still drag on for several months, as seen from the last election in 2017. But more worryingly, 6 in 10 of those polled by Forschings and in their exit poll for broadcaster ZDF said nobody would succeed in filling the void left by Mrs. Merkel when she leaves office. Jens Geyer of the Socialists and Democrats group in the European Parliament told Politico if Mr. Schultz managed to get elected as Chancellor, Germany would take a much more active role in Brussels, but one political expert has said a German election result without a clear outcome would be seen as a disaster for the EU. Joel Reland, a foreign policy researcher at the UK in a changing Europe think tank, told Express.co.uk, months of coalition negotiations would be the worst possible result for the EU because it has a lot on its plate, and would thus benefit from the clear leadership of one of its two major powers. The US withdrawal from Afghanistan and furore around the AUK-US submarine deal have made discussions of how to bolster EU security and strategic autonomy a pressing concern.